SMT Nation, we back. We are speed testing FirstNet by AT&T. Uh, this particular testing on a newly upgraded AT&T site. We just did the AT&T business account access testing. And we were getting like, I don't know, it was like 1.1 gigabits per second downlink. 120 on the uplink. Truly impressive stuff. But we're not seeing this on FirstNet. We're not getting the same throughput. We're getting... Kind of a different experience, not as fast. Uh, you'll see ping times a little higher too. 39 ping on the unloaded, 567 and 37 for the loaded ping times, jitter at 6. 423 on the down, 37 on the up. Let's go ahead and run a second test. Always find it interesting how the first that experience is so different. Uh, you typically don't get the same throughput. It's actually faster <laughs> on AT&T. You know, like whether you have a business account or a consumer account, it's it's it's, un, it's interesting. Uh, whatever the configurations are to the first net core, it's just different, right? So probably less bandwidth. We're probably only getting one channel of N77 instead of the two parts of the channel, right? So I don't know if it's D band, C band, or if it's DOD, but we're probably just connecting to one there, one or the other. 415 down, 38 up. Yeah, it's an interesting thing. Now, if there was an emergency, if there was you know preemption you know that was be that was activated you know i would continue to see those those speeds and that access while you know other lines would be you know de-emphasized or deprioritized or what have you but pretty good throughput but uh you know first that is definitely not <laughs> on the same you know core as regular at&t accounts business accounts consumer whatever even prepaid uh very different outcomes uh so like if you look at the detailed results here um, actually, let me go here. I'll show you guys. So right there in the middle, at like 807 and 808, you'll see those were the AT&T tests. And then right above them, those are the first net tests. It's a really different experience. Just fine, perfectly good, but there definitely is a difference. So you may not be fighting to get on first net after all, <laughs> if you're into speed testing and what have you. Anyways, just thought I'd share that with you guys. Thanks for watching the content. Share with me your experiences with FirstNet. If you have any questions on it, your AT&T access, what that's like. Uh, excited to see what you guys have to say in the comment section below. You're the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard.